Welcome back everyone. Just going to load into Auto Heroes for day number two. Um, so far, yeah, it seems okay. Um, it's a lot like AFK Arena, uh, which isn't good, which isn't bad. You know, it's just one of those games where you know you're going to have to grind it out. Oh, what's that? Okay, mysterious item. Can't be bad. Holy Asher Jar. Okay, so I guess that patrol that I went on yesterday um, gave me some cool stuff. Let's have a look to see what that does though. I like the fact that the map itself has these little things that you can click on, interact with. Um, so I'm assuming I get some potions, some experience, some, uh, what's this, battle, that must be battle, deploy heroes, uh, just hit autofill, reward, okay, cool, cool, so you get some gems by doing that, uh, there's the merchant guy down here, uh, to be honest, I'm not entirely sure what's worth buying, um, just yet, so, I think I'll just buy that, because you need a hundred of those little purple things um, to get an elite uh, five-star hero. Who are you? I'm pretty sure I'm using you at the moment. Am I using Cassia? Let me have a look. Yeah. So. It's not? Oh, okay. Cool, cool. So. So, equip some more uh, armor, I guess. Just go quick equip. Uh, um, I'm assuming this guy needs some too. To be honest, uh, you will feel pretty overpowered to begin with. Um, you pretty much get a lot of the resources to level up these guys. Uh, I guess I've just been doing them relatively equal, so I don't have like a level 100 DPS or a tank or a healer. Uh, tank's a bit low actually, I should probably upgrade uh, old mate iron wall here to 50. I do have um, one of his copies, so to awaken you need his original copy, so the level 50, so if you select the level 50. Select the level 50. Okay, it's already selected. Then you select his copy, and then you need a corresponding hero that's a five star in that faction. So, same situation with Maeve. I do not want to sacrifice her to build Iron Wall and vice versa. Because it looks like we're using the Royal Faction a lot, or at least the game has given us predominantly the Royal Faction. So. Uh, just for the bonus, I don't think I want to mess around with that too much. I'm curious as to why it tells me that it's got this, um, this is a very old school RPG looking, uh, setup here, I like it. Um, why have you got that? Maybe you want me to fast upgrade. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, what's this? What's this? Alright, maybe not. Oh, I'll play around with this. I'm still new to this day two. I'll check that out. Uh, okay, oh... Ooh, we do, we have to change skills. Ooh. I mean, be rude not to use them, right? Uh, but I'll just come back to that in a sec. Let's just check the mail and see what we got. <clears throat> so I did buy the miniature monthly card. Okay. Curious as to why you're telling me I can open shards. I can't use them. I can't use them. Huh. Why are you telling me I have shards? 
do I have to press all these things? Oh, oh man. I'm not blind, am I? Because you need 50 of these things, right? You do. I think it just means that this was the new one we got. Anyway, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah. So this is not too bad. So you basically need to complete as many of these tasks on all the tabs across here. So there's a little number up in the top uh, left-hand window. So see how it says three from nine. So I've got to get to nine again, and then I raise my rank from D to whatever the next one in the alphabet is. Um, uh, okay. So it seems like you can pretty much just do this without having to really worry about it. Um, what's this fortify thing? Awaken heroes? Yeah, you can auto awaken heroes. What's fortify? I've done it once, but I don't know. I don't remember how I did it. Um, okay, it doesn't really. Sadly, doesn't give you too much information. Um, class patrol. Let's just do that for free. Oh, okay, so in three minutes we get some more gems. That's nice. What else is there? Uh, one thing is, um, like AFK Arena, if you've played that, uh, there's the wagon feature. So if you wanted to, like, digress or regress, I should say, uh, a hero that you're not using anymore, you might have leveled up and put all the resources in. You just select that hero and you confirm it. I can't really do it because all these guys are in patrol. Maybe I could do it on this one. No, he's defending. No, I'm not going to try. So you stick him in there and basically it gives you the option. Um, sometimes it costs uh, gems, so be aware. It might cost you a little bit of gems. Hopefully it's not. And then disband. You basically just want to, after you've done your summoning event, you kind of just want to get rid of the uh, three stars because you don't really use the three stars. But before I do that, let me just go into here. Let me go Awaken. Let's go Auto. Yeah, I'm not even sure if you... Um, can um, make a three star into a four star. So, so this, yeah, well, we got some food, that's cool. So we, we got two additional five stars there, so non-natty five stars. So I assume that there's like a limitation to uh, where your five stars can progress from in the sense that um, natural five stars have the yellow border or the gold border and your non-natural five stars are gonna still remain with the brown border so you probably can't evolve them past that if there's future evolution um oh, it's just looking at me we better we better press it all right hopefully we get another ludwig because i really want to build him um probably we'll buy the deluxe card as well just to get those additional you know i'm just going to hit reveal all oh, i've got one ledge come on give me a ludwig come on do it yes that's right yeah Sometimes you just go to tempt fate and press that button. Alright. <laughs> Let's have a look to see whether or not I can. What's this? Uh, sort of like AFK Arena. It's alright, but it only lasts an hour, so. It's a little bit of a gotcha buy, you know what I mean? Like, uh, impulse buying. So that's not very good if you, if you, if you don't have, uh, the willpower to resist that. Um, oh yes, very nice. So I wasn't going to do this, but I mean, yeah, it's day day two. So I guess I don't want to make this too long. It's already nine minutes. Um, heck, why not? We'll just uh, we'll just evolve this guy or awaken him, I should say, and let's go. So this is my first awaken. So when you awaken it, it looks like you get the second feature of the skill. Um, and you get like a max cap bonus. So let's do it. There we go. Alrighty then. So you, you change these, you got a little rainbow star up there. Um, okay, okay. Well, I wonder if we get any achievements for that. Oh, yeah. Hall of... Hall of Fame. Uh, okay, I'll come back there. So there's little things like that. Like Hall of Fame is just uh, you're tracking your server server progress. Um, I don't know how to do Academy yet. Uh, shop. 
uh, I guess you can spend gems daily if you really want to. Um, some of these things look like you just kind of just want to save your resources and then buy them. Make sure you do your daily bounty quests. Um, I wonder if there's like a auto deploy. Anyway. I'm sure I'll come back and uh, talk about some of the other aspects. Maybe do some campaigns, see how we go. Maybe do some PvP. But uh, thanks for watching. Have a good one.